Jay and Matt, let me All guess right. what your weather word will be. Well, you know, I was watching that story and I was listening and, you know, the, it, you mentioned the frogs yeah. and that whole thing. What does a frog, the noise a frog makes is? Croak. No, it's not croak. <laughs> You're trying to use that as your weather word, aren't you? Uh, I have no idea. Uh, it's ribbit. Oh, ribbit. 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 Yeah, right. Now, how in the world does that fit into a weather forecast? Wait, that's the word. <laughs> that wow, is, okay. That is the word. I, I no ran idea. into a, a, a lovely young lady, yeah. or a younger lady last night. Is this and, at Home Depot? Uh, yes, and <laughs> she said, I only enjoy your weather word when it's really difficult. Yes, So that's great. that's for her. That's for her. That's yeah. so funny. We were... <laughs> Ribbit. Ribbit. All right. <laughs> Boy, what a challenge. At least the forecast isn't too challenging. Look at the sky right now. We've had peaks of sunshine, but we've got another little wave of energy moving through, so it's kicking off some clouds again. This way out towards the west is actually a lake effect band or lake enhanced band uh, that's been moving in areas of Erie and Huron County. Notice it gets darker as you get out there. We're not done with the rain. We're not done with the cool, but we're really close. That's the good news. I don't know how I'm going to get riveted into the forecast, Jay. I'm just trying to think of some sentences with that in it. All right, we'll get it. Here we go. Temperatures right now. Coolest out towards the east is where we've had the most clouds in the showers throughout the day. Meanwhile, we've sparked some low 50s baby steps right across our central counties. Wind continues out of the north. It is gusty. So here's the radar right now. Notice how we've ramped the rain back up Lake Geog, Ashtabula County. Well, here's that band I was talking about. It's been focused on Erie and even western areas of Lorain County this afternoon. But first things first, pretty good rain coming down right now. This is mainly just south of I-90. Really starts to pick up as you get that terrain increase. We've got decent rain in Chardon right now out towards the Trumbull Township area down in Cleveland area. We're dry right now downtown, but you get south of town along 77 dealing with some rain and then out towards the west. Pretty decent showers. These come and go as you get back towards Wakeman. Just saw a pretty decent downpour and that extends down towards the Mansfield area. Also Ashland just got some rain. Final stop takes us to the Orville area. Just got out of some rain there. We're dry in the Canton area for now, but some of those showers off towards the north will work their way in. Notice the peaks of sun we're getting. We're getting some drier air working in here tomorrow. More sunshine than today. And notice how that clearing isn't far off. 150 miles west of here, we've got completely clear skies across Indiana and more where that came from. This little pressure is finally getting some legs on it. It's heading out towards the east. We're going to be looking good here in the days to come as we've got about 1,500 miles of not just spring-like conditions, but warm temperatures from here to the west coast. And that is going to be moving in here as we go through time. Look at some of these numbers, 60, 70s, even 80 right now in Pierre. Would you think South Dakota and North Dakota are warmer than us right now? Well, that's the case. 30 degrees warmer. How about that? Where do we go from here? Nothing but up. We've got 60s in the forecast by Friday. We're well into the 60s Saturday, and we're talking 70s next week as we bring in a ridge, which is not what we've had over the course of the last couple of weeks. National Design Mart Hour by our forecast. Models clearing us out too quickly. We're going to have rain showers around here this evening, maybe even a spotty shower tomorrow morning. And then we bring some drier air in here. That's good. But with cold air aloft, I think we spark a couple showers tomorrow afternoon. Temperatures, though, up into the 60s as we go through time. We'll dry out this weekend, and then in the next week, we're dealing with some shower and thunderstorm chances. We'll talk more about that in the next half hour. Meanwhile, we'll... Oh, I was trying to get it in there. Frogs love it, and they love to say ribbit. There you go. They love the rain. I was trying to figure out a play on words with ribbit and rip it, but I, I just couldn't do it, Jay. All right, 57 tomorrow, Union Home Mortgage seven-day forecast, 60s over the weekend. Just a stellar weekend around here, and there's your rain and even thunderstorm chances next week. That was a tough one today. I wish I could have done better on that. That was lovely. Hey, you got you it. it. Got it. Frogs love to say ribbit. Good job. Ah, could have we'll done take better. It. Connected right. to the rain, it all made perfect sense, Matt. Thank, Thank you, Matt. Thank you.